She see money all around me I look like I'm the man So y'all, so as you can tell by the title of the video I'm gonna be doing the what's in my bag tag today And y'all, I have tried to record this video three times This is the fourth and final attempt If this shit don't go, I'm not doing it anymore Well yes I am, but maybe later on down the line um so basically the what's in my bag tag is just a youtube tag that people basically just show what's inside of their purse um yeah i don't think there's really really a point in doing it besides just showing what's in your bag um i guess to kind of compare what's in other people's bags like and what's in your bag <laughs> so uh, I'm just gonna get right into it so I, I'm gonna start off by showing y'all my purse this is the never full in the Damier Bean <clears throat> pattern I can't remember what size this is it's not the big one but it's not the small one it's the medium size one I don't remember what the I don't remember what size it is um, I've had it for like three years now so, okay, let me just start pulling stuff out. I have so much stuff in here, y'all. It's ridiculous. I'm going to just take out the big stuff first. Um, This is a journal. I just always write a bunch of stuff in here. My memory is so bad. Like, I know some of my friends are probably watching this. Y'all know my memory is terrible. And if I don't <laughs> write stuff down as I'm thinking about it or type something in my notes really quickly, I literally will forget it and never think about it again. It's so terrible, and I hate it so much. Um... And my memory used to be really good. I just don't know what happened. Um, next, I just got this little Victoria's Secret pink um, bag. And it just has like pads and tampons and Midol and ibuprofen. And like, what is that? Oh, moist wipes. That kind of stuff. I've had this pouch for so long. It's beat up. Next. Oh, I got my phone charger, y'all. If you don't carry a phone charger with you everywhere that you go, you definitely should start because you never know when you're going to end up somewhere and your phone is going to die because my phone is always dead. Like, and it's ridiculous because I always have a charger with me and it's always dead. So, yeah, I think that's something that everyone needs to carry in their purse. Oh, these have been in my purse for like three weeks. These are just like some coconut covered um in dark chocolate like coconut chunks i love coconuts where is these expire yes dang april 26th dang that's in like a few days okay and they're really good by the way y'all y'all should check these out if you like coconut and like it's like the perfect amount of like sweet and like i wouldn't say it's kind of like coconut's kind of bitter, so it's like perfect, like sweet and bitter, and it just tastes really good. And I just love coconut the way it tastes by itself. So with the dark chocolate, it just makes it even better. If you like dark chocolate, I know some people like absolutely do not care for it. Um, oh, I have this little pouch. I switch purses a lot, and this is all the stuff that I usually keep in every single purse. So I just keep it inside of here because it's easier, I think, to just take it out of one purse and stick it in the other one, grab my charger. Because if I switch to my, it's like a smaller purse or something, all the rest of the stuff won't fit. So I'm definitely going to always keep the main stuff with me. So I guess I can just open this up and take this stuff out. Um, this is the CO Bigelow um, lip creams. I get these from... Bath and Body Works. I, this is the, my first time trying this one. It's the um, Natural Shea Butter. My favorite one is the Mentha one. And it's like in a teal package. Um, it's my birth control pill. I don't know if y'all care to see those. There's another pack. This is, I mean, just gum, obviously. Another pack of gum. And I have a pen. Y'all, I went to... Um, I went to Jamaica one summer. And you know how when you, when you fly international... Um, you always have to like fill out the forms when you get um, off the plane to just to say that you understand what you can bring in the country and what you can bring out um, like what, could, what you can take back to the states with you and like stuff like that well it was a obviously we were on a huge plane so there was like so many people and there were no pens to fill out the paperwork so everyone was like standing in line like a huge line waiting to use the pens to fill out the paperwork before you could even go get your bags. So we spent, I don't even know how long standing in line. 
um, trying to get our paperwork filled out because there was like five pins and then the people that, I'm sorry, I keep burping, I don't know what's going on, <laughs> but the people that work at the airport were like being stingy and they didn't want to let us like use their pins and stuff, so like we was just struggling, like thugging it out with five pins and it was just, it was ridiculous. Next. Um, this is some lotion. This is like, okay, my friend Morgan <clears throat> had this laying on her bed one day and I used it and I was just like, oh my God, this smells so good. This is the Coconut Passion and it's from Victoria's Secret. Focusing. And it's kind of dark outside, y'all, so I'm trying to figure it out with the light situation. Um, So yeah, I used this lotion of hers and I absolutely loved it, so I went and bought the same one. And it's almost out. And y'all know what's crazy? I always have lotion on my purse and I'm always ashy, like... My, not like my hands and stuff but it'd be like the back of my arm like I don't know I live in Louisiana so you really don't need to put lotion on like well not this time of year because I mean you could put on a little bit when you got the shower but you don't have to like lather yourself in lotion like when I'm at home the climate is so different and it's so dry I have to like mix lotion and Vaseline together and like put it on my body like even in the summer when I'm at home, just because it's dry, you know, just a, just a dry climate. And here it's really um, humid and moist. Um, this is a headband. I don't know why that's in my purse. And these are just my headphones. Oh my gosh, y'all, I hate that the um, iPhone 7s now have this for the um, headphones. Because my MacBook, I have to carry two sets of headphones with me usually. I'll keep my regular headphones that work with my computer and my backpack. Because I can't use the same headphones for my computer and my phone. So it's just, it's just a struggle. It's ridiculous. But, I mean, first world problems. Um, my car keys. Oh, I got this for Christmas last year. This is just a little LV um, keychain thing. My nails look so white. I just got them re um, repolished. Okay, so on my keychain, I got some mace. This is the key to open the gate in my apartment. Uh, I don't know what that key's for. I've never used it. Oh, this is for something in my apartment. This is my door key. That's my mailbox key. And this is the key to my, sh to my shop, the shop where I work. Um, oh, and I got my car key. For some reason, oh, I went jogging this morning, so I took my key off of the key ring and put it inside the pocket on my tight. So I'm guessing that's why I separated. Um, but yeah, that's my car key. And then next, I have my wallet. <clears throat> this is the Emily wallet, and it's the same pattern as my purse. Obviously, they're two different colors because they're not um, cut from the same cloth. I got the wallet two years after I got the purse. So, um... It's still pretty new looking. I have like a couple like markings and stuff. I don't even know if y'all can see that. Some little stuff. Um, I like my purses when they get worn out and they start getting soft and everything. So I like to, um, I don't know. I just like to love my purses. You know, just so they get soft. When the, the leather is still hard, like when you get a brand new purse and the leather is hard, it, it like it hurts to carry it on your shoulder. It cuts your shoulder and it's just uncomfortable when they get soft and like, Y'all see how the strap is just like bending? It's like the best feeling ever. And especially if it's like a light leather, when they start to patina, oh my God, they're so much prettier when they start to get a little, um, get a little used, get a little worn. They look so much better, I think, than when they're brand new. Um, and the inside of my purse is actually very dirty and needs to be cleaned. That's everything. So I guess I can show y'all. Oh, and I always usually keep water in my purse, y'all. But since I'm at home... I don't have any water in there, but usually when I go anywhere, I will put water in my backpack or water in my purse. Um, I have water bottles. In my, I usually keep a couple bottles of water in my trunk because I don't know why, y'all, I'm always just, like, so thirsty. Like, I have to just drink water, like, all day. And I don't need, I don't know, it's just, I don't know. I guess it's a good thing. So, this is the inside of my purse. This is just the red one. Um, it's dirty. There's some change in there, too. Yeah, I guess I can show y'all what's in the pouch. I don't even know what's in the pouch. Another pin. Oh, these are some flyers that we made at my job for the grand opening. Y'all, and okay, the first time I recorded this video, I found this check in my purse from the nails, the, um, the nail salon I used to work at for $371. <laughs> and I should probably insert the clip from the first time I recorded so y'all could see my reaction because I was thrown off. Like, but anyway, I tried to um 
it's been past 90 days, so you can't cash it anyway. So I tried to um, contact my um, my boss and see what they want to do about it because I guess I just never deposited. I mean, well, obviously never cashed it. Um, I got a scrunchie in here. I got a nail file. I don't know if it's just, I don't know. I, I always have a nail file. I don't know if it's just, I don't know if before I started doing nails, I carried nail files. I don't think I did. But it's just like, I don't know. It's just something now. Sometimes I'll just find like something wrong and I'll just need to like file it. And like when I break nails, I need to file it right then. Like I have to, because if you don't file it right, especially like when you get st like a little piece stuck on the side or something right there. If you don't file it right then, you'll break the whole nail. And these are my natural nails, y'all. So I've been trying so hard to hold on to them. And like this one, I don't know if y'all can see it, probably not, cracked earlier and I like got some nail glue and I was like drowning the nail, trying to just keep it together till my nail appointment next week because <laughs> I cannot, my nails cannot break. They just can't. Um, these are some more. Oh, these are the old keys from, from the shop where I work. We just recently got our locks changed, so that's why I have my new keys on my key ring. So, yeah, guys, that's pretty much um, everything that's in my bag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys think I'm missing something, definitely leave a comment below and tell me um, what I need to have in my bag that I don't have in my bag. I try not to put too much stuff in here, y'all, because the bag is already, like, heavy as it is just because of the leather. Um, so when I pile a bunch of shit in there, it just makes it worse. Oh, I, I'm trying to stop cussing because mom be watching my videos. Um, sorry, mom. <laughs> but, yeah, I just, I don't like putting a lot of stuff in my purse. But mama's purse do be heavy, so maybe she need to, um, watch my video and find, see the essentials that she needs in her purse and what she don't need in her purse. And I also don't carry any makeup in my purse, you guys, because... For, for one, I don't even, I wear makeup maybe like two or three times a week, if even that. I try to wear makeup at work on the weekends, but most of the time, it don't happen. Um, I just don't, I just don't be wanting to be bothered with it. Honestly, y'all, I just be wanting to just chill and just not have makeup on. It's just such a, I mean, it's not like when I have makeup on, it's not like a huge, like, oh my gosh, my face is so like, it doesn't feel like bad or heavy or anything. It's just like... I don't know. My natural skin be glowing, so I don't be really caring. I do my eyebrows, put on some lashes, but usually that's it. So, um, I don't carry makeup in my purse because I don't retouch it because I don't wear it often. So, um, I feel like I forgot something. Oh, well, if I forgot something, y'all will let me know, right? <laughs> so, anyway, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Follow me on Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. All the information will be in the description box below. And let me know what you guys think I'm missing from my bag or what I don't need in my bag. Because I know this is a lot of stuff. Um, I know y'all gonna probably say I could do without the journal. I probably really could, but y'all, my memory is so bad. Like, y'all probably think I'm over-exaggerating, but I'm not. And I'm rambling right now, so I'm just gonna stop. So anyway, you guys, enjoy the, enjoy the rest of your day. And I'm gonna try to edit this video and put it up today. So, um, yeah. And I'm sorry about, like, taking so long to post the videos. I'm trying to, I be busy, y'all. I'm trying to, like have time to record and have time to edit and, and then I have my Wi-Fi and my apartment is terrible so then I have to go somewhere else to upload my videos because if I try to do it at home it says it's going to take like 36 hours and then I wait 36 hours and then it still doesn't upload and it's just terrible so um I'm gonna work on you know being more uh consistent with putting out videos and stuff and also I'm going to be going to Miami um May 4th through the 9th for the Rolling Loud Fest so definitely be out uh, um be on the lookout for a vlog um, during that um, weekend because it's going to be super fun and what else oh I'm moving to a new apartment on May 1st so I'm also probably going to be doing an apartment tour maybe probably not right off the bat but maybe a little later on in the bat my brother is going to be moving here in August and we're going to be roommates so maybe we can do the apartment tour when he gets here like do it together so definitely be on the lookout for that as well and I don't know I don't know what other kind of videos I should post I definitely want to do some story times and by the way if you guys watched the other story time I had up I actually deleted it because I don't know I, I saw the guy again and I don't know, I don't, I'm not saying, I don't know if he saw the video, I'm not saying he did the video, but it's just like, soon as I saw him, I was just like, oh my god, I'm gonna delete that video, like, just because, it just triggered something in my head, so I, de I deleted the video, if you didn't see it, then I don't know what to tell you, um, 
yeah so that's it <laughs> So yeah guys, like I said, if you haven't um, subscribed yet, please subscribe to my channel and be on the lookout for more videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one.